Labrador Retrievers are incredibly loving and playful dogs with an athletic build and a naturally devoted nature. You may be watching this video as you are looking into getting a lab pup, but as a first time dog owner are concerned about whether this is the right breed for you. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you whether or not this loving breed is a good choice as your first dog. Labrador show. If this is your first time here, my name's Hattie. I'm a certified canine leader here at Fenrir CanineLeaders.com and this channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the Labrador. Then how to become high level canine leaders that can raise the perfect labs. So if you're a lifelong Labrador lover thinking about getting one or just started your journey with your new lab pup, then this channel is for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a future Labrador video. So let's dive into today's video and find out whether or not the popular Labrador is good for a first time dog owner. There are many things to consider before bringing a puppy into your home, especially if this is your first ever experience of having your own dog. Over many years and through careful selective breeding, the Labrador have proven to be incredibly trustworthy and reliable dogs, both out as working dogs and in a home environment, which makes them an amazing breed for a first time dog owner. They are well renowned for their sensitive nature, as you may already be aware of after seeing lots of lab shoes for service, assistance and therapy dogs. They are playful dogs that desire love and affection from their human companions. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, the Labrador has a naturally devoted nature and is known to be loyal and caring towards their owner. Labradors are playful, but they are also easygoing dogs that display a wonderful temperament. They're known to be a great dog for the family, especially with children, due to their sensitive and affectionate nature. They are known to be great dogs for the family, especially with children, due to their sensitive and affectionate nature alongside their dependable companionship. Their well-balanced temperament is inherent to them, but as with all dog breeds, you are required to provide them with lots of socialisation from a young age, with strangers and other animals, for them to grow into good-natured and well-rounded adult dogs. Although they need quite a bit of care and attention, they are an incredibly good choice for a first-time dog owner that is after a dog that is loyal and affectionate. The Labrador Retriever is a very intelligent dog, which is proven with the amount of service labs you can find these days. It is their kind and extremely willing nature that makes them relatively easy to train. Their love for their human companions makes them extremely eager to please you. They benefit greatly from knowing who their leader is and their place in their pack. A lab's high intelligence means that they love to engage in different mental stimulating activities, which again can make training this breed relatively easy. Hey guys, sorry to interrupt the video. I just wanted to quickly let you know, if you didn't know already, I have a completely free course on the principles of canine behavior. As a canine behaviorist, I've put this together with my years of experience, skill set, and knowledge to help you understand all the areas of canine behavior that are important for you to become a high level canine leader. And then you can fix your dog's problem behaviors at home, or maybe take the first steps into working with dogs with problem behaviors. So again, if if you want to check out that course, it's completely free of charge. The principles of canine behavior, there'll be a link down in the description box below, and I can't wait to see you over on that course. As with all breeds, you need to be willing to put in the time and effort to train your dog. Although the lab is renowned for its loving and easygoing temperament, they can easily develop unwanted bad habits and destructive behaviors if they're not trained properly and consistently from puppyhood. They adore being praised and have a high food drive, so this type of rewarding can come in handy when training your pup. Labrador Retrievers are well-built and strong dogs with a very athletic build which means that they need a large amount of exercise. Originally, the Labrador was bred to work alongside fishermen in Canada, which meant a lot of hard work swimming and retrieving for long hours of the day. They are commonly used as a working dog in a hunting environment, retrieving game for the hunters. Their double coat protects the dog from the cold and water, which enables them to be great hunting companions and definitely explains their love for swimming. Exercise for the lab should be a combination of daily walks and off-lead runs with plenty of playtime and mental stimulation. Their large amount of energy needs to be released to prevent any bad habits and behaviours from developing. Also, labs are commonly known to become easily obese if not exercised and fed properly, so they need appropriate levels to stay fit and healthy. Labs need a minimum of two hours a day of exercise. They are a very loving dog and thrive off their human's attention and if they are left alone for too long they can become very distressed and develop destructive behaviours. As a retriever it's in their blood to want to retrieve so teaching your dog to retrieve is a great way to exercise them as it uses physical and mental energy. Social interaction with other people and dogs is important for the Labrador due to its naturally social nature which also provides a lot of mental stimulation. It's super important to do lots of research before making your final decision when getting your puppy, so we highly recommend watching more videos and reading up about the breed. 
Overall, the Labrador Retriever is very well suited to first time dog owners that are willing to give the dog the care that it requires. They're incredibly loving and have an impressive reputation as being highly trainable and intelligent. If you're looking for an active companion that also loves just to spend time with you whatever you're doing, then the Labrador may just be the best pup for you. I hope you enjoyed today's video and if so make sure you hit that like button, get involved down in the comment section below and don't forget that if you're new here make sure you subscribe. We have two dedicated lab videos coming here every week so I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the Fenrir Labrador Show.